SUTD is a very contemporary university with a very unique mission to create knowledge and educate technically grounded leaders. One of the central themes of d -Man d is a vision that in the future that we'll be able to create products by putting different types of material in very precise point-by-point -point locations in space. And there are three major themes in that direction that we're focused on. One is around additive manufacturing, multiple materials and creating multifunctional components, parts, products. Another is around the 3D manufacturing of composite structures. And a third around 3D digital textiles. We use in the additive manufacturing kind of arena, voxel printing, the ability to place multiple materials precisely point by point in space. This is an example of a leg of a table designed to explore how we can use modern day computational and manufacturing tools to rethink ancient ideas in, in this case, in Japanese joinery. If you look carefully, you can see a very detailed grain within the structure that it simulates the effect of wood grain, kind of, but it's created by a 3D multi-material printing process. We use a multi-material composition and geometry combination to create tight, structurally rigid joints. Voxel control technology really changes the way we think about design. So we're not thinking anymore about geometry. We're thinking about uh, creating materials from the ground up. Uh, it allows us to create textures and microstructures that have a variety of both design and engineering properties. So we can look at optical properties, um, tactile properties in terms of, say, sense of touch, but also thinking of um, acoustics, structural corrugation, or thermal properties. The technology kind of enables us to increasingly kind of blur the classical lines between a material and a structure. Additionally, we've used voxel print technology to not only 3D print, but to 4D print multi-material composite structures, creating products that can change their shape and their form in time as well as in space.